There's one spot in Edmonton that is really moving people with its concerts. It's 100 years old, but is only now being recognized as one of the coolest spots in the city to catch a show and a ride. Graham Neal has more. For decades, people in Edmonton use streetcars to get to concerts. But on this night, the concert is on the streetcar. A huge warm round of applause for Justine Vandergriff. Justine Vandergrift has played a lot of places, but this is her first streetcar concert. It's kind of like a cozy, cozy house concert, and even cozier because people can't go anywhere. Last night you said there's something in the water. It was a sold-out show to a capacity crowd of 30 appreciative fans. It's really cool. Yeah, something totally different, right? The idea for the streetcar concert came from Tad Hargrave, who thought this is a perfect way to listen to an intimate performance. A hundred-year-old streetcar on the high-level bridge, which is a hundred years old, uh, sunset. It just all seemed really romantic and nice. And Vandergriff says there's not too many places she's played with views like this. You get to see the whole city in its finest and uh, you get to hear local music. Yeah, it's, it's just a really beautiful experience. And if you desire an experience like this, you can rent the streetcar for $200 an hour, like Hargrave and Vandergriff did for their concert. We've got lots of charters booked already and we're getting more people interested. After tonight's interview, it'll probably become more popular. <laughs> Once you have the streetcar, it's not hard to get the performers. And tons of musicians would love to do it. The audience is totally listening. It's an experience everyone talks about it. Did it inspire you? Gonna be writing like a streetcar song now? I think I, I think I better. Yeah, I'll get on that. Graham Neal, CTV News, Edmonton.